we wanted to create a frantic action game with a little extra something that pushes your skills in a creative way. So we made this Fanga, the Time Shift Warrior, a single player hack and slash with a tactical twist, coming to PC on February 13th. Hello, my name is Thibaut Le Guay. I'm the game director and lead game designer at Sandor Studio. I am excited to show you our very first game, which we've been working on for the last three years. This Funga, the Time Shift Warrior. In this Funga, the Time Shift Warrior, you play Ime, a powerful warrior gifted with special powers to prevent the new kingdom of Antala from falling to the hands of its old enemies, the Raxus. Ime's adventure is divided into three acts and one epilogue, all set in different and unique environments, divided into multiple arenas. A battle ends when you have defeated every single enemy in that arena, opening the path to further fight. To vanquish the Raxus, you get a varied arsenal of spells and weapons. That's for the hack and slash side of the game. Now, the tactical twist is Ime's ability to rewind time a few seconds in the past, restarting the arena entirely and summoning clones of her past selves. These clones are called Remnants and will replay the exact same moves and attacks Ime performed on her previous iteration, allowing you to literally be in multiple places at the same time and clear the arena before the time is up. The rewind system is triggered in three ways. When the timer is down, when Ime is defeated, when you deliberately choose to rewind time. Depending on the situation, you will have roughly 20 seconds before the start of a new iteration, and eventually you will unlock new remnants to use in battle. Some enemies or situations will need only one remnant to fight by your side, but others will need an army of your past selves. You can build your tactics in a creative way by combining remnants and other tools at your disposal, tailoring each run to fit your playstyle. While in combat, you can switch between three powerful sets of weapons, each with their own strengths and combos. You start with the Shamshiran shield, a perfect set for melee combat that allows you to stun your enemies and parry some attacks. You will then unlock the Chakrams, a very fast and agile set of weapons that gives you great mobility and allows you to attack your enemies at range. Eventually, you will unlock the Trident, which is perfect against powerful enemies and bosses. It can also unleash a special powerful attack when fully charged. Spells and runes are powerful magic that enhance Ime's weapons, abilities and remnants. They give you more tools to approach each arena like you want. Ime's arsenal also includes a powerful ultimate ability that will help you turn the tides in your favor, even in tricky situations. You can also use one of the various runes to grant you passive bonuses. Runes add another layer of gameplay customization to truly make the experience your own. From hordes of enemies to boss fights in the story mode, you will need to use and mix every tool available to save Antara. And for those of you who want to push your limits, there are timed challenges in the story mode that will really test your strategies. The Figments of Battle is another mode that allows you to return to previously cleared arenas. You'll shake up your fights with various affixes, reshuffle enemy layouts, and challenges that require you to adapt your strategy. Here, a dedicated scoring system will allow you to track your performance. This Fenga, the Time Shift Warrior, releases on February 13th on Steam and Epic Game Store. You can try the free demo right now to get a first taste of what to expect and start improving your skills. I hope you will be as thrilled by Ime's journey as we are at Sandor Studio, and we can't wait to see how you will unleash your creativity to save the new kingdom.